Hi there. Streamers and content creators. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're diving into an exciting topic. Using a two-computer setup for your live streams. By the end of this video, you'll learn how to maximize your game settings on one computer while ensuring a high-quality stream on another. So, why do so many professional streamers opt for a two-computer setup? Well, it's all about efficiency and minimizing potential issues. By splitting the workload between two machines, you significantly reduce the chances of encountering problems during your stream. It's like having a fail-safe system in place. Another major advantage is that a two-computer setup solves the problem of your stream going down when your game crashes. With this setup, your streaming PC handles the stream independently from the gaming machine. Even if your game crashes and you have to reboot, your stream will continue uninterrupted. There are a few different methods to achieve this setup, but today I'm thrilled to introduce you to an OBS plugin called Teleport. The best part? It's super easy to use and completely free. Let's get started with the installation process. Simply head over to the plugin page, and you'll find the link in the video description below. Once you're there, click on the provided zip file to initiate the download. Once the download is complete, navigate to your downloads folder and extract the files. Now, depending on your operating system, Windows, Linux, or Mac OS, locate the appropriate folder within the extracted files. In our case, we're focusing on Windows. So, right-click on the DLL file and copy it. Next, head over to your OBS directory. Typically, you'll find it in C, Program Files, OBS Studio, but do check your specific setup. Once inside the OBS directory, look for the OBS Plugins folder. Open it, then navigate to the 64-bit folder. Right-click inside this folder and paste the DLL file you copied earlier. And just like that, Teleport is now installed and ready to go. Remember to restart OBS if it's currently running to ensure that Teleport is properly integrated. Once you're back up and running, let's configure Teleport to send the signal to our streaming PC. Within OBS, to set up Teleport, head to the Tools menu and select Teleport. In the Identifier field, give a name to the machine you're using for transmission. Let's call it, Gaming PC. If you wish, you can adjust the quality settings according to your preferences. Finally, check Teleport Enabled and set the port number. I'll go with 5555, but feel free to choose any available port. Keep in mind that if your firewall blocks certain ports, you might need to unblock the chosen port to ensure smooth transmission. Once you've entered all the necessary information, click OK to complete the setup for the sending machine. Click on the plus icon to add scene. Select Teleport from the menu. Click on Refresh. From the drop-down menu, select Gaming PC. Now, let's move on to the streaming PC, where we'll configure Teleport to receive the signal. Make sure Teleport is installed on this computer as well. Within OBS, go to the Tools menu and select Teleport. Give an identifier to this machine, let's call it Streaming PC. Enter the same port number as before, 5555. Enable Teleport and click OK. Now, in the scene where you want to add the Teleport feature, click the plus icon, select Teleport, and refresh the list. From the drop-down menu, choose the gaming PC that you set up earlier. Click OK. You now have the scene and audio from your other machine seamlessly transmitted to your streaming PC. That's it. Setting up and using Teleport for a two-computer live streaming setup couldn't be easier. It's a fantastic alternative to NDI, and it gets the job done flawlessly. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please take a moment to hit that like button and leave a comment. Your feedback and engagement mean the world to me. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel for more tools, tips, and tricks to level up your live streams and YouTube content. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Happy streaming!